check his bag, gets harsh lesson in American law. Far too many Muslim immigrants come to this country not grateful, but feeling entitled. Entitled to skirt our laws, entitled to impose their own customs, and entitled to feed off the welfare state. Well, one prominent Muslim immigrant just learned his lesson the hard way that you don't get to refuse orders from the police. At least not any longer. Not now that Obama is out of office. Tesh El Mielaji, an Egypt-born immigrant and founder of Islamic Civic Association on Staten Island, threw a childish tantrum when he was randomly selected for a bag check before boarding the Staten Island ferry. Due to his ridiculous behavior, police were forced to put El Mielaji in handcuffs. He was then frisked and later issued two summons for his outburst. El Milaji insisted that the check was not at all random, and that he was selected because he's an Arab and a Muslim. The knight called him out on his faux outrage, noting that many other people had their bags checked during that same time frame, including whites, blacks and Hispanics. Given that El Milaji heads a Muslim activist group, it's no surprise that he'd want to spark a media storm over his alleged mistreatment. But the days of being able to get away with that kind of deceitful behavior are over, are over.